Hello, I'm Marinda Bota. I'm a South African voiceover artist and native speaker of Afrikaans. I've been in the voiceover business for well over a decade. And the one thing you always have to deal with is punctuation marks. Now, you may think, punctuation marks? What's that got to do with being a great voiceover artist? With giving the best vocal delivery that you can? Well, it's very important. In fact, it's so important that it's a good idea to ignore punctuation marks as much as possible. Copywriters use punctuation marks in scripts that are written for the eye, that are written to be read. Punctuation marks assist in bringing the meaning across in a sentence. But in conversation, we don't use punctuation marks. As human beings, we speak in half sentences. We place pauses in between words when we are lost in thought. We place emphasis on words which we deem to be important, even though there may be no grammatical reason to do so. As a voiceover artist, it's your responsibility to bring the script off the page. And that often means that you must ignore the punctuation marks. So, as a general rule, use punctuation marks as a guidance, but don't take it too literally. Let's have a look at the script for a TV commercial. Training Corp understands the pride you take in your work. We are ready with advice and resources like a manned telephone line 24-7 to guide you every step of the way in your pursuit for valued training for your clients. Training Corp, we take pride in your work. Now, ignore the punctuation marks and read it again. Try and see if you can get the sentences to flow into each other as if you are telling a story to someone and not reading it. Then also, you might want to place emphasis on certain words that you think are important, so see if you can spot those words that you think carry importance. Lastly, you can use the pause. A pause is a very powerful tool. A pause is any beat of silence from a fraction of a second to a few seconds long between words. The important thing when using a pause, and this is really important, you must have something going on in your mind as you sustain that silence. But we'll look at this again in a different tutorial. Let's go and have a look again at our TV script. Thus, for our example TV advert, I would do the following. I would ignore the comma between to guide you and every step of the way, as it flows better for me. I'd place a pause in between valued training and for your clients, and I'd place a slight emphasis on the words pride and your. These are my choices, and by no means the only way to do it, but have a listen and compare it with the correctly punctuated sentence you see before you. Training Corp understands the pride you take in your work. We are ready with advice and resources, like a manned telephone line 24-7 to guide you every step of the way in your pursuit for value training for your clients. Training Corp, we take pride in your work. So, to recap, don't necessarily work the punctuation marks. As a voice of an artist, you have license to ignore the punctuation marks if it makes the flow of the delivery better. Obviously, don't change the meaning of the content. But if taking the punctuation marks away will improve the overall delivery and performance, do it. I hope this video has been helpful. I'm Marinda Boeta from South Africa. Thank you for watching.